Another German wonder kid for you at 19 years old. Looks pretty good to start off with. Let's take a look. Florian Wirtz is a German 19 year old, four caps already to his name. Uh, he is contracted right now to Bayer Leverkusen, 36 million to 170 million, 74K per week until 2027. Uh, yeah, so right off the bat, money is going to be an issue, possibly. But, I mean, if you can get him on loan, if possible, that he's just amazing. Dribbling a, four, a 15, first touch of 15, passing a 15 technique of 16. He's got some really good numbers for midfield and attacking midfield. Uh, it would be nice to see some of those increase, especially, I mean, acceleration and pace of 13 and 14, not too bad. Definitely would like to see those grow a little bit. Leadership of eight, positioning of eight is not great. Uh, he's not going to be, you know, jumping wise. He's not going to be heading the ball all that fantastically, but marking of seven. So you might have an issue defensively to a degree, but overall, some of these numbers, I mean, as a 19 year old, you expect to grow the, all these, some of these numbers. He's looking pretty good. However, for Bayer Leverkusen night from 2019 to 2023, he's already made 60 appearances with 13 goals. So he's doing a fantastic job. One of the reasons why I picked him is not only because he is a wonder kid that people should actually learn to scout, but apparently Liverpool are taking a look at him. I mean, obviously everyone's going to be scouting this kid anyway, but you know, there's always rumors about every little player with Liverpool. So this is just another one. Wanted to check him out. As you can see with career milestones, not a lot, but he's got some good ones. 2021 next gen runner up. So right off the bat, you can tell he's going to be something special in the future. Uh, German first international cap, UEFA championship under 21 winners, German newcomer of the year, third place, newcomer of the year, again, third place. Uh, so yeah, he's he's got some time to fill this all out and I'm pretty sure he will. So let's get 10 years in the future and see what happens. So 10 years in, 2033, he is still at Bayer Leverkusen. It looks like his loyalty score must be through the roof. Only seven caps, though, at 30 years old. I would have expected a bit more, but some of the, I mean, these numbers have grown dramatically. Acceleration and pace, not so much, but Agilia 16 is nice. His mentals are through the roof. Leadership has grown, as <laughs> is positioning, uh, and some of his technicals have been fantastic. First touch, passing, and technique are all amazing numbers. That's seven caps. Interesting to see. As you can see, he spent his entire career here, minus the, the three years he was at Cologne. But 373 appearances, 104 goals. Bundesliga this season, 30 appearances, 7 goals, 7 assists, 714 average rating, 6 and 1 in the Champions League, 1 goal, 2 assists, 723 average rating. So definitely helping his team out. Career milestones, unfortunately, he's got a lot of seasonal best 11s, and that's it. Uh, Germany seasonal best 11 once. But first international goal against Poland at age 20 and then just doesn't feature much at all in, in the rest of the, the German squad. But nothing for Bayer Leverkusen. Uh, he definitely must have a really big loyalty score because otherwise he would have just traded for some other team that's going to win. But he stuck with them. So, I mean, kudos to him for that. Now, injuries might be a part of it. Uh, he's got a lot of moderates here, a couple of majors. Uh, from the start of, let's see, 2022, there's your 2024 right there, all the way above. Yeah, I mean, that's a lot of injuries, some slight, some moderate, so it's going to be half and half, and he's going to get some. So he's going to be out here and there. If I look at the career stats, though, he's still getting 29 and above. Yeah, there's 25, right, 27, 28 season, uh, and still 7 point whatever. So he's still doing well. He's still playing games. I wouldn't worry too much about the injuries personally. I mean, yes, there are a lot. Yes, half of them are moderate or possibly worse, but overall, I mean, he's still getting a lot of game time. 27, I mean, if you look, 17, 22, 23 is the one year he had less than 27, 25 appearances, 25 appearances. So, um, but still, he's still playing a lot. And then Bayo really doesn't have a lot to his name. I truly one of world's glo soccer global superstars. And yes, I know it's his soccer. I don't know why it's his soccer yet. His only winner's medal is the European championship under 21s to his name recognition from the soccer community for his own achievements of under 17 player of the year, Germans newcomer of the year, third place on two occasions and next gen runner up. So that really is it. Um, I do want to know when he's going to retire. Will he see any more silverware in his future? Let's find out. So this is the end of the 2038 season. I looked one season ahead at 2039. He is no longer in the database. So this is when he retires. And as you can see, plans to retire 7-12 during 2038. 
at the age of 35. Nine caps, so we did get a couple more, but rated right now 950K to 2.8 million. Still earning 60K per week. Uh, impact sub, though, only. Bundesliga stats, 11 starting, 14 off the bench, two goals, nine assists, 701, still doing a very high mark. Uh, and I mean, acceleration of 10, pace of eight, really has dropped dramatically, but his mentals are still through the roof. Some of his technicals are as well. Uh, still, marking of six has gone down. Tackling of nine, not good at all for that side, but he's an attacking midfielder. What do you expect? So injury-wise, yeah, from here, 2033, all the way up, he still has a ton more. Uh, really mixing it up, though, with uh, two majors, two moderates, three minors, and a couple of slights. So, I mean, still missing some game time here and there. Uh, it's especially towards the tail end of his career, I would start to worry. But overall, I mean, he's still not missing a lot. So, I mean, if you look at career stats again, 25, this season is not good. 32, 28, 33. So he's going to be averaging around the 29, 30 mark thereabouts. And Leverkusen only got him for 100 k 180K. That's fantastic pickup right there. But yeah, that loyalty score, wow through the roof that you don't really see anymore. They won the DFB Pokal in 2034. He's got a trophy to his name now, uh, at least in the last several, you know, 10 years or so. But everything else, I mean, really hasn't picked up much at all. So that is the career of Florian Verts from 2023 all the way to 2038. A fantastic career for him. Putting up his boots, hanging up his boots at 35. And yeah, that's all she wrote. So I am Safian FM for the Football Manager Blog Channel saying thank you as always for watching. Take care and enjoy. Thank mm -hmm. you.